Among the oldest of old, he was the oldest of all. Grandfather Turtle had seen cities rise and fall. He knew the rising of the tide, the turning of the seasons. He knew everything happened and it happened for a reason. He would smile at the baby turtles when they'd first awake. He would gently watch over them, see them make mistakes. He'd tell them what would happen and mostly, he'd be right. You will learn this one day too, when you've seen as many nights. When the currents changed, they followed him. He always knew which way to swim. Well, one day, great old grandpa was teaching his grandsons, and he saw something in the sea and blinded by the sun. I've never seen such a thing before, he whispered to himself. And before he knew it, swept away to a place he'd never seen. Of course, great old grandpa would not admit his lack of knowing. He led his little grandsons to a place he saw was glowing, a deep dark cave inside a swirling mass of neon arms, and going down into the cave beyond the jagged carns. This, my boy, is the way out. I know it now for sure. I've seen so many nights before. I know so many doors. But they awakened the dark shadows as they swam into the deep. The little turtles saw it first. They were on their feet. Come on, Grandpa, swim away. We'll get out some other way. He sighed and thanked them, and he swam, and now it's he who follows them. And at long last they all do return, Grandfather sighs, his heart does burn. What troubles you, they all do ask, a memory, far in the past. This monster we saw scares me so, I saw such a thing, so long ago. And I remember my father once told me, a book of answers lies beneath. I once attempted, but did not achieve. The book has knowledge that we need. The little turtles took a vow and promised their old man to get the book back to them so they could make their plan. And so they went and swam and swam and then one day they found it. They opened up the book to the page that has to do with life, that promised all the answers to and solutions to their strife. But opening up they just saw page upon page of laughter. They knew returning this book to grandpa would be a kind of disaster. And so they returned without the book and they promised him to be brave and have adventures and every day to swim. And Grandpa laughed, it's just as well, and now it seems quite silly. To think a book could solve it all. What was I thinking, really?